Good laundry habits can be hard to keep up. Between reading the care labels, separating colors, or replacing dryer sheets with these wool dryer balls, it can be exhausting. But the one thing you should always do after every dryer cycle is clean your lint screen. Here's why you should clean your dryer filter every time. Did you know dryer fires are the most common causes of home fire hazards? And 34% of these fires start because of failure to clean the dryers. Look at all the lint that gets trapped in here. And this is only after one dryer cycle. Can you imagine how much it'll add up after a few rounds? Lint is highly combustible. Excessive amounts accumulated in the filter over time can also block the dryer vent, which expels hot air outside. This can lead to reduced airflow and become a potential fire hazard. That's why you should also check your dryer vents and give them a good cleaning at least once a year. Lint trapped in the filter can also increase the drying time, which means your dryer might take twice the time and energy consumption to dry your usual load. Dryers are one of the appliances that consume the most energy around the home. On average, if you run your dryer three times a week, it uses about 769 kilowatt hours of electricity per year, while your washer and refrigerator use only about 590 kilowatt hours each. This can add up to your monthly cost if your dryer isn't running efficiently. If you notice it's taking more than two or three cycles to dry a load of towels, it might be time to clean your lint screen. This can help your dryer heat efficiently and reduce drying time. Another tip is to dry your heavier items like towels or bed sheets separately from your lighter weight clothes. You'll spend less time drying each load, thus saving more energy and cutting down your electricity bill. Cleaning the filter regularly also helps your dryer run smoothly, making your appliances last longer. Not to mention, your clothes will last longer too. The debris caught in the lint trap can sometimes wear out and even damage your clothes while it's running. So never run your dryer with a blocked lint screen. Here's a quick and easy way to clean your dryer filter. Start by removing the lint filter from the dryer and use a vacuum cleaner to suck out any debris that may have spilled inside the dryer's filter slot. Next, gently roll the lint off the screen with your fingers and throw it away. Never rinse or wash the screen with water to remove lint. Wet lint is very difficult to remove and will build up over time. As disgusting as it may be, remove it only by hand. If you still notice any residue, Give it a deep clean by soaking the screen in warm soapy water and use a toothbrush or nylon brush to scrub both sides. Always dry the lint screen thoroughly with a clean towel before putting it back in. It's that simple. As a good rule of thumb, give your dryer filter a good deep clean every six months. This will get rid of any fabric softener or detergent residue, buildups from dryer sheets, or even dirt you might find in there. Don't forget to subscribe and follow our channel for more tech tips. Happy laundering!